What's up guys, welcome to Tribe Grey Wolf Unboxed. As you can tell, we are not in the wolf den. We are here with HTC Vive in San Francisco. Today we are unboxing an XR Innate by HTC Vive. I think one thing to note about this is it's 99.99% paper. So the boxing of this thing is 100% recycled. Did someone really set up their car alarm? <laughs> Environment first packaging. Let's open it up. The first thing that I notice is that it's numbered from one, two, three, and four. And it's like number one is a QR code that you're gonna scan and it'll start your setup process for the headset. We're gonna skip that part because I don't think it's live currently. Number two, we have the charging cable for the headset itself. Oh man, it's hard to open. There we go. The head strap that can go from left to right and a four foot charging cable. And it's USB C to USB C. Number three. And this is the replaceable battery pack that goes on the back of your head. That's a way sick. It's not even that heavy. And it smells good. But <laughs> I guess we're just building this thing. It's like build a bear, except let's build the vibe. <laughs> now let's check out door number four. It looks like on the back of the door, we have two USB-C to USB-C charging cables. And this is gonna be for the controllers. I love these controllers. So there's no external batteries. So what you do is you charge it by USB-C here. Now it looks amazing and super light. Like it's super, super light. And then the left controller, same thing. USB-C tracking ring because it has inside out tracking. So sick. Now, door number two. We, we missed a step. <laughs> That's okay. Because it was under a number two slot. Let's call this door number five. <laughs> I believe this is the headset itself. Look at that. And it already has the stems on the end of it. So it's in like glasses mode right now. That is amazing. Can you see this? Look at that. I can already put it on. It's just ready to go. And it has an internal battery in the front of it. So it doesn't actually need to have the back on to be powered on. Which, that's insane. That's sick. Okay, this thing is insane. It is super, super light. The first thing I'm noticing is it's easy to get fingerprints on because I haven't had this for two seconds. So I already got my fingerprints. So be careful touching the front face. Oh yeah, that feels good. I'm gonna have my watch come over here and try this on. Miss Gray Wolf, you'd like to try this on? Yeah, let me try it. Oh, this is nice. I love how lightweight it is. And it's not squeezing my tipples or, or my tipples or the back of my head too much. I like it. Is that cool? Yeah. What do you see? <laughs> what I love the most is this amazingly so super soft face plate. Look, it feels so good. They absolutely killed it with using foam and using a uh, cloth material. But I'm gonna show you what these look like side by side. Okay, so now this is recording what I see through the headset color pass through of another HTC XR Elite. So you get to see what I'm seeing and see me. That is some Vive Inception. Boom, look at that. That's sick. What I really like is that anytime if you want to start recording, all you have to do is hit the power and the volume up button. You just click them once, makes a super rad noise in your ears, and it lets you know that it's recording. Now check this out. What we have here is by HTC Vive. It's a hard shell carrying case for your XR Elite. It has this nice little strap on the side here. And when you screw off the top, your XR Elite can just slip right in there. Open it up, you got your little stems. It just click right in, click right in, I said. 
That's the wrong side. <laughs> they click right in. <laughs> and then you're good to go. <laughs> there you have it. This is the XR Elite by HTC Vive. I'm Mr. Grey Wolf, and I'll see you on the next one.